Hey guys, welcome to another Donald Trump review. Today I'm going to try a meal with Maggie, is the company I guess. This was sent to us by Maria to try out. This is from Berlin, Germany. Straight from Germany. Um, so she sent this to me um, to try on the channel. It's kind of like a pot noodle or a ramen noodle or a, pot, a cup of noodles or whatever. Where you put boiling water in it, you let it set, and then you stir it and eat it. Um, so this one is, uh, it's in German of course. It's spaghetti in a creamy cheese sauce. It's 264 calories for the bowl. And it is, does it have a size on it? 62 grams. That's, that's how big it is. So what you do is open it up. Pretty straightforward, just like all of these noodle cups, assuming you can open it. Okay. Open it. You got a little line here. I'm a, I've got boiling water. You boil your water whatever way you can. Microwave, stove, whatever. It doesn't matter how you get boiling water. Pour it into the line. There we go. Stir it really good. And she put it in her direction. She likes to cover them. Uh, just put the aluminum back on it. I'll also do that too. It doesn't say that specifically, but I've always done that as well. And she said she likes to do that too. So yeah, so I'm gonna stir this really good. Get all that powder so it's not all clumpy. Still see some clumps. Yeah, so now I'm gonna set a timer for five minutes. I'm gonna let that set and uh, I'll be back when it comes out. All right, time's up. And I said when it comes out, I meant just when the time's up is all I meant. Nothing, uh, did not put it anywhere else except to sit right here on the counter. So it, uh, it really got thinned out. The noodles still feel a little firm, but it's been just a little over five minutes. So I'm gonna put this, uh, let's see. Um, uh, I can I can pour it out into a bowl. Hold on. I just happen to have a bowl right here. We'll see what they look like. I know normally you would just eat them out of the container, but let's see what they look like. Quite a bit of noodles in there. Might be a little easier to eat out of this bowl than, than that container. So I'm going to take this over the table, give it a try. Alright, so I didn't give any time to cool off really because it's been sitting for five minutes anyway. Um, I don't know, I got a fork. I also got a spoon. I'm going to try with the fork first. Pasta is really uh, dense and chewy. So soaking pasta in boiling water for five minutes didn't quite um, cook it as well as it should be. Yeah, it's really, really undercooked. I try a spoon. That way I can get more of the soup part. I haven't got any like um, like crunchy bits of pasta, so that's good. It's all just very firm. Kind of like if you if you take it off the stove, like spaghetti off the stove, like maybe a minute or two earlier than you should have, and it's kind of got that tough texture. Um, that's what this is like. If it's set for a little longer, um, maybe it would soften up some more. I don't know, because the water's after five minutes, not that much, it's not really that, that hot anymore. I really like the taste of the the cheese sauce. That that's the winner for me. It's almost like a cheese soup. Um, of course, it's in German. Can't read any of it, of course. Um, if there was anything I could possibly pick out because it has a little bit of an oniony flavor, and I'm assuming that's what the green parts are. So it looks like chives. Um, so that may be what I'm tasting. Good flavors, okay texture. Um, like I said, the pasta is a little firm, but that's it. Um, it's a thinner white meal, so you'd want to eat with a spoon instead of a fork. Fork would not work. Um, overall, it's pretty decent. I wish the pasta got a little softer, but that's the that's the case with a lot of these that have actual spaghetti instead of like a rice noodle, which softens up a lot faster. Uh, at least that's my experience. Pasta is a lot, it takes a lot longer to, to like cook, to soften up. So this one, I'm gonna give it a three out of five. It's, it's a good flavor, but then the pasta kind of brings it down a little bit. So it kind of bounces out at about a three out of five. But um, yeah, it's definitely worth, if you're in Germany and you get these and you want something quick to, to make uh, or easy to make, go for it. Um, 
it's got a good flavor to it. It's just the texture's a little full firm. So anyway, hope you enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, and thanks, Maria.